Hey guys, it's Andy here, back again with another mod for 7 Days to Die. The pimps have added a, shall we say, an interesting new item for Alpha 13, which, as far as I can tell so far, looking at the XML files and uh, the, um, the crafting window menu thing in game, doesn't appear to have any real use yet. I'm sure you've all found this item. If you search toilets, now that they uh, don't just fill jars automatically with water, you can find human turd. Now, in the description, in the, uh, the UI menu, if you uh, click on it, it says it can be thrown to distract zombies. As far as I can tell, this doesn't actually work, and there's nothing in the code that suggests it does this either. Um, so pretty much, its only use is you can just sort of throw it around. Like so. Um, so I wanted to see you know, if we could come up with some interesting ideas to make use of human poop in a survival situation. Got a couple of ideas already, I'm thinking of making this a little mini-series. 101 ideas for what to do with poop. Um, but today's, well the first one I've come up with today is a drink. This is based on a real drink. Uh, it's a type of coffee known as Kopi Luwak. It's, um, Incredibly expensive because of the way it's produced. Uh, basically, the beans are eaten by this animal called a civet cat, and the cat sort of digests them. And particular enzymes in the stomach of the cat have an effect on the on the beans, which supposedly makes them incredibly tasty. Um, I don't really understand who thought it would be a good idea to try it, but you know, each to their own. So, very simply, you craft it exactly like normal coffee. Um, you just need a cooking pot uh, and a, in a campfire. Uh, you need coffee beans, water, and our extra ingredient. Um, it takes 20 seconds to brew, and we'll be left with one Kopi Luwak coffee. So, what I've done to make it different from the regular coffee is because you have to use a sort of reasonably uncommon item that you can't craft currently. Um, I changed a few of the parameters that it has. Uh, firstly, if you drink a regular coffee, it gives you a plus 100 instant stamina gain. So if you're out of stamina, really low, it'll boost you up to full if you're a very low level. In late game, once you've got your stamina up to towards maximum, towards the 200 mark, um, obviously the, the Kopi Luak copy, I increase the initial stamina boost to 200, so it can max out your whole bar. Um, another couple of downsides with normal coffee is, one, it reduces wellness, it has a very slight 0.1 wellness decrease for every one you drink, and it has minus 10 to your first. So, contrary to what you'd expect, drinking the coffee makes you 10, 10 points more thirsty. So, for the Kopi Luwak, I removed the thirst thing completely, it's just neutral, it doesn't do anything, and I gave it a plus 0.1 wellness boost, so it's better for you. So it gives you a little bit of wellness, a bigger, bigger stamina boost, and doesn't have any negative impact on your thirst. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this one, guys. Um, a bit silly, I know, but you know, it's a game. We're having a bit of fun. So if you have any ideas of your own for particularly what we could do with poop to make it a usable item in the apocalypse, leave a comment down below. It'll be interesting to hear what you guys come up with. Um, I'll also leave a link in the description for the code if you want to use it in your own game. Uh, other than that, um, I'll see you next time.